you have a strong new crop coming. Yeah, it seems so. You definitely have a gift for things. Hey, you want to go to a fight tonight? No, I don't like fights. I'm just kidding. How about we go and see a movie and have dinner? We'll go to the Comanos Hotel. I'll pick you up around five. How does that sound? Mm, that sounds okay. I guess uh, it'd be nice to get out of the house. All right. All right. See you then. Okay. Bye. Sure is a nice house you got there, ma'am. <laughs> it sure is. Do you want it? <laughs> sure thing. Listen, ma'am, how do I get back to the 680 from here? I'm off my general road. Oh, oh yeah, sure. Um, you just want to go down that road there about a mile, mile and a half, and it'll take you right to the 680. Um, but you want to be careful because that sun's going to blind you. Oh, see, I'm, I'm in no hurry. I take the trip from Seattle down to San Diego every year. Um, I just like to follow the sunshine. Wow, that must be like a nice way to live. I've always wanted to. Uh, I, I, I suppose. Uh, see, ma'am, I, I, I mend pots, sharpen knives. You, you got any work for me to do? No, no, I don't. Uh, I've, got, I've got a special tool. Please, ma'am, do you have any work for me to do? Uh, I, I haven't eaten dinner yet. No, sir, I don't have anything like that for you to do. Oh. Well, what are them plants, ma'am? Oh, <laughs> well, these are chrysanthemums. I grow the most beautiful chrysanthemums in the entire neighborhood. Oh, like a, like a long stemmer? They look like a puff of smoke. <laughs> well, that's kind of a funny way to put it. Well, listen, ma'am, I, I, I got a woman down the road. She, she doesn't have any chrysanthemums. She really likes them. Do you, do you think I could? Oh, my gosh, yes. Would you like to bring her some? I can give you some beautiful ones. Oh, well, if, if, I, if I could. Absolutely, absolutely. Um, let me cut some for you. Um, but listen, you have to remember this. When you give these to her, tell her that she needs to plant them before they bloom about a foot apart in the ground. It's very important. Well, can you remember that? Y yes, ma'am. Okay, great. Um, gosh, have you ever heard of blooming hands? Uh, I can't say I have, ma'am. Oh, God. Well, it's something like this. Um, oh, you know, don't worry about it. Forget it. Sometimes when I'm sitting in the back of my truck. Oh, I know exactly what you mean. Like when the night is dark and the stars are so sharp pointed. It's just, it's just so lovely. You know what? Wait a minute. <laughs> Must be really nice. I wish women could do things like that. Well, with all due respect, ma'am, uh, I don't think this is really the life for a woman. What do you know? What do you know about things like that? I'm sorry, ma'am. I, I don't know. Uh, that'll, that'll just be 50 cents. Here. Thank you, sir. I appreciate Thank you. it. Make sure you keep that moist. I will. Goodbye, ma'am. Bye. Lisa, are you ready? No. No, I'm not ready yet. Wow, Lisa, you look nice, different. Strong. Nice? Strong? Well, I've always been strong, Henry, but what do you mean by nice? You're just playing a game with me. You look strong enough to break a calf over your knee. Henry, don't talk like that. 
I've always been strong. I've just never really known how strong I really am. Uh, okay. Well, you go get your jacket and I'll go pull up the car. It'll be good tonight, a really good dinner. Yes, it'll be nice. I had to take you out to dinner more often. It really brightens you up. At the fights, do the men hurt each other very much? Well, yes, Elisa, they do. Do you want to go to the fights? No. No, I don't want to go. I don't think I'm strong enough to go. your diamonds and you've got your pretty clothes and the chauffeur drives your car